welcome to Halo Moon Tarot. This is your weekly reading for, where are we at here? Cancer, that's right. It's all about you, Cancer. See what's happening with you. This can be any aspect of your life. Take it how it best resonates for you. Cancer, what does Cancer need to know? Oops, we don't want all these out at once. Never know which one's which. Cancer. What does Cancer need to know? There we go. Ah, there you go. See, it was meant to be the one that showed its face first. They always come out if they're supposed to. So it's definitely someone who's somewhat apprehensive. It's a person who checks everything very carefully before they move forward. But it is a card of movement, even though it's very slow. Someone's waiting for the perfect time here. Someone's waiting, you know, they're looking at the situation, the details. It's a little apprehensive, but I feel this is somebody here who's kind of protective of something here. Yeah, this is someone who's a little unsure, maybe a little worried of rejection. Okay, it's also someone who may have failed to recognize an opportunity. See, someone here is moving very slow here. It's an opportunity. There it is to manifest. This is someone who has all the tools, the information. See, it's an energy of willpower, determination, creativity, you know, manifesting this new beginning. There's something new here. That's what the magician does. The magician. Oh, yeah, there it is. Something new. <laughs> Lovely. Yeah, someone's not too sure here, though. So someone who's failed to recognize, maybe they were moving too slow, maybe they were apprehensive. So there's definitely something going on with this person. So it could be a rejection. Thank you, but no thank you energy, moving too slow, manifesting something new. Someone's going to miss an opportunity because they're moving slow. There's the Empress. Oh, yeah. There we go. We have some lovely energy here. Now, this could be something educational. The Empress is uh, very, uh, very creative, very hardworking, very balanced. So there has to, something to do with a windfall of abundance. Now, this could be a house, a home, a financial foundation. But there's something new here, uh, something beautifully new, too. I think you got a person here who has failed to recognize this Empress energy. So somebody here who I feel is having some kind of realization that they've missed an opportunity because they're moving slow. But it's possible with this Empress energy yourself, Cancer, uh, you may feel like someone's, you know, moving too slow, so you're you're manifesting something new. Going off, this could be school, okay? Going off, off on a new path, something educational, going to school. Uh, but I do feel it could be a somebody starting a business in their home. Uh, it's an energy of a financial foundation. There's a lot to celebrate at the end of this, so... Yeah, we'll see where this goes. And I feel with that, this, this Knight of Pentacles, slower moving energy. This is, you know, it's somebody slow and steady wins the race. It's someone who's failed to recognize an opportunity, you see. Mm -hmm. Knight of Pentacles, why is this here? Why is the Knight of Pentacles energy here? Yeah, see a realization. Somebody's having a sudden realization. There may have been a rejection. Someone's missed an opportunity, maybe was rejected by this Empress energy because they were moving too slow. The tower's coming down, you see. Thanks, but no thanks. Yeah, it's an energy of someone who's just, you know, they take their time. But uh, I feel like what needs to be realized here, the Knight of Pentacles is someone who takes their time. They have a tendency to be kind of slow because they are apprehensive about whether, you know, what they're trying to manifest is going to come true, if it's going to happen. And that's generally what it's about, looking at the details of a situation, planning carefully before they take action. You see, someone here is not sure or feels they missed an opportunity. It looks to me like the Empress has gone, thanks, but no thanks. Uh, the Empress is the one that has uh, the tools here in this situation. This is a person who's mastered the elements, mastering life, very creative, very capable of starting something new. So I really like that energy on the bottom here. Four of Cups. Why is this here? Yeah, see, we've got someone here. See, someone here is having a realization. See, they've missed an opportunity. They're now folk. They're very focused on money. A lot of focus on their finances. Someone who likes to plan for the future. They like to be prepared. So I do feel this person's looking at this energy of manifesting, and it has to do with communication. It's manifesting through communication. Mercury energy. Yeah. What is this magician up to? Cancer. 
Yeah, see, someone's walking away. Someone's walk away from someone. But someone's looking for something now. They're having the realization why somebody walked away, why they rejected them. Okay, because they were moving too slow. The Empress uh, could see the apprehension. If someone's apprehensive, well, thanks, but no thanks, you know. It's the way it goes. Off I go to manifest something new. Yeah, see, someone's shining a light on that energy. Someone's shining a light on that, you see. It's a person who I feel chose their words wisely. They Somebody sometimes keeps things to themselves, um, right? They keep things to themselves here. They're not telling the whole story or communicating clearly. There's a lack of clarity. Uh, someone was possibly just dragging their feet, uh, more focused on their money here, and someone's walked away and starting something new. Someone's trying to find out they're curious where somebody is, what they're doing. Have they started something new? Well, it certainly looks like it with the Empress. But this is somebody who's shining a light. They're now having that aha moment. They're seeing the, the clarity. See, things are becoming clear to this person. Why this Empress energy walked away? You see? There it is, right there. See, it's a person who chooses their words wisely, chose their battles. Now, it's possible this person walked away because they felt apprehensive, but it's an energy of someone who's chasing something here. See, it's someone who's becoming more decisive as they look at the, uh, the details of a situation. It's about a person who uh, definitely more focused on their finances. I can see their energy. So someone's missed an opportunity they failed to see. So when somebody is waking up here to this, the realization. Oh, yeah. It's the energy of chasing with the Knight of Swords. Yeah, this person's becoming more decisive, you see. But it's also a person who chooses their battles. This is someone who would rather walk away than argue or fight. Or maybe even somebody walked away so somebody couldn't reject them because <laughs> there could be that realization okay thinking oh yeah i'm going to be rejected so i'm going to i'm out of here right so it could go that way as well yeah we have the queen of pentacles look at that we have a power couple here we have the couple people focused on finances now this is an energy of the empress someone who's mastered um the elements, somebody who has all the tools has everything they need and the queen of pentacles is looking at the um the details of the situation. So someone who's not so sure they see a future with someone because there's a lack of clarity. See, this is someone who uh, wasn't very decisive the way they were communicating. They weren't saying something they needed to say. So this is where the Queen of Pentacles gets a little uncomfortable and goes, yeah, I'm not really comfortable with this. I'm just going to focus on my money. <laughs> I'm going to do me, right? I'm going to take care of me here. Yeah, but I think we've got this King of Pentacles who's now becoming a little clearer about the situation. The sun, yeah, see, it's an energy of someone expressing their feelings. See, this is someone who kept something to themselves. They didn't communicate clearly. Uh, they may have rushed in before they thought things through and then rushed right back out again. So someone's walked away here. It looks like the Empress has walked away, definitely focused on money, just grounding themselves, someone who takes care of their house, their home, someone who's preparing for the future. Uh, nice energy. That's the Empress. So we have the King of Cups. See, somebody wants to start something here. Now it's possible uh, you have a new person here. This could be yourself here, Cancer, as the King of Cups, ready to start something new. You could be the King of Pentacles or the Queen. But there is the birth of something new here. Uh, this is somebody, it's time to take action. This is to do with someone's hopes and dreams here, you see. Yeah. We have the King of Cups. Somebody is, is feeling it here. They're in their emotions. They want to start something. Yeah, it's an energy of somebody opening up, putting all their cups on the table. See, so look at this beautiful, positive energy. High vibrational, very positive, very happy. Um, this could be a new person coming towards you. Or it's like you're, I say, it could be yourself going towards this Empress energy. Um, but there's that King and Queen of Pentacles, the power couple. I still feel like it's the same person. Somebody moving towards emotional fulfillment, see? It's a realization about what makes them happy. It's somebody who probably need a little time to figure out what makes them happy. But I, 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 I'm I, not a, a fan of the Four of Cups when I see the um, Queen of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles there because there's definitely been someone who's failed to recognize the Queen of Pentacles, okay? And it's also with the Queen of Pentacles may have failed to recognize the King of Pentacles energy, why someone walked away if it was them, 
you see, a little apprehensive. So there's some tower moment here. This looks like there was a rejection. To me, it actually looks like somebody rejected someone because they were afraid the other person would just walk away. <laughs> Which looks like the King of Pentacles. So we have the Empress here, yeah. See, multiple opportunities and a delay. See, somebody was moving slow. That's a realization. They're dragging their feet. They need to hurry up. Someone's now in a hurry, okay, to communicate before somebody um, manifests something new, you see, before other opportunities come in. So... Yeah, end of delays, things are speeding up. I see that a magician, some kind of communication that's going to take things down another path. This has to do with, could be a commitment marriage. If you're seeing somebody here and they've been kind of dragging their feet, you may decide to just say thanks, but no thanks, I'm walking away. But yeah, I, I think we got someone here who's a definitely, there's a windfall of abundance here. Good fortune. See, things are speeding up. It's going down that path. There's definitely some things being learned here. Okay. But it, like I say, I, I don't really feel like someone's going off to school uh, in this energy. It's possible. There could be something, little side messages here. But it definitely has to do with a strong financial foundation. Okay, it has to do with commitment, marriage, and a reason to celebrate. So I feel there's going to be a reason to celebrate at the end of this. Now, it could be uh, communication, an invitation of some sort um, as well. Yeah, see, there's the energy of the hopes and dreams. Someone's letting go of things that no longer serve them. Okay, yeah, see, it's energy. Somebody here was playing it safe. King of Cups sometimes plays it safe. A little bit cautious how much they offer until they're sure. Okay, so they're going to get the emotional fulfillment. The queen, of, one thing about the empress, the empress does not indulge. The empress will not indulge somebody, okay, who doesn't communicate clearly. Anybody who rushes in, rushes out, okay. This is an energy of someone who kind of likes to be indulged, you know. Uh, they reach out and they want somebody to fill their cups. But I feel like it's actually flipping around the other way. You have a person who's realizing that. This is, you know, they've been playing it safe, dragging their feet. They're having that that tower moment so they're now in a hurry they're worried the empress is going to take off in another direction you see the empress isn't indulging it's an energy of the star little aquarius energy releasing things that no longer serve see this is someone who's playing it so safe uh, that they're actually failing to recognize uh, what they have in front of them which is that beautiful empress energy this beautiful person who um you know wants a partner somebody who wants a partner uh, marriage commitment a strong financial foundation but someone is leaving behind things that no longer serve them to go down this path you see someone is releasing something here and letting it go but it has to do with a person who's realizing their hopes and dreams this is everything they could ever dreamed of see this is someone realizing this is everything they could have dreamed of that's usually what happens when someone walks away. Then the person goes, oh, no, this is my, uh, this was everything I could have ever hoped for and ever dreamed for. Having that realization, things are, you know, this person's becoming very clear. Uh, the empress is going to move on and get other opportunities. So, oh, yeah. This is someone who didn't want to see you know, The empress wanted something. The empress wanted some kind of a commitment. Um, the other person didn't deliver. They were dragging their feet. But the Empress also is like, well, I'm not going to keep giving to you and indulging you, right? If I'm not going to get something I want out of this. And that's the Empress energy. The Empress is no fool that way. So much to celebrate. Why is this here? Yeah, there we have. So it could be a reconciliation, but a lot of times it's just an energy of release. This is somebody who needs to have more faith in themselves. This is someone who lacked the faith in themselves that something would be um, possibly successful or this would be, you know, uh, a good union, you know, going down that path together. It's a learning experience. Someone's learning something here. And that's the epiphany energy, learning and realizing this is everything they could have ever wanted, their hopes and dreams. And they played it so safe that the other person walked away. See, they kept all their feelings to themselves. They didn't want to expose their feelings. Well, they're about to. They're making a decision here to open up. So there's a massive healing for someone here. And it's a decision to release anything that no longer serves. Okay. 
Yeah, the Empress is loving the Empress. The Empress is loving themselves first. This is someone who needs to learn to love themselves first too, you see. And I feel there's something to do with that. It's a healing energy. I feel someone's about to get something they want here. <laughs> this King of Cups is going to give somebody what they want. So we have the judgment, see? Someone tempering their passions and tempering their emotions, you see? It's an energy of two people. Someone's realizing here. They, someone made a bad decision. They made a, the realization they made a very bad decision. And it has to do with the magician, the, the way they communicated. They weren't you know, saying everything. They were keeping something to themselves here, not telling someone the whole truth. Yeah. But the thing is, why? Why is this king of pentacles not seeing the whole truth why are they not speaking the whole truth why are they keeping that whoops of course it goes flying yeah see they're apprehensive this is they were apprehensive the stories they tell themselves in their head see it's a lot of cerebral energy a lot of thinking so somebody who's quite logical you know they choose their battles they chose their words wisely but they didn't have they're not having success here someone's walked away this is also a person if they feel something you know they're not going to get emotional fulfillment they just walk away See, it's a person here tells themselves stories in their head. They're having an epiphany. See, they're very apprehensive, maybe even a little bit shy about putting themselves out there emotionally. So, you know, they're, someone's made a very bad decision. So uh, it's possible it looks like some kind of reconciliation or reunion. Uh, but often it's just a decision to temper their passions and temper their emotions, to be patient, see, to be more patient. It's somebody here who I feel, I don't know, they came in very suddenly and then kind of started to drag their feet. They became apprehensive. Uh, more likely worried the other person will walk away because it looks to me like someone rejected someone because they felt they were going to walk away. It's somebody who's trying to avoid uh, a rejection. See, yeah, see, there was a lack of reciprocity. This person wasn't reciprocating. They weren't giving. The emperor, or the empress energy. The empress only gives so much, you see. This is somebody who I feel is kind of stopped giving, more focused on their money. This is somebody who uh, doesn't really want to give. See, they're not sharing. Uh, they're holding back information, how they feel, what they like, don't like, whatever it is. Or they're not giving someone the time of day. They're dragging their feet, you see. So what I feel is this is what's happened to this Queen of Pentacles energy becoming this Empress. Um, Somebody's definitely done some inner work here, though. I can see that. I feel this Queen of Pentacles energy is uh, somebody who's uh, now focusing on their money. You know, thanks, but no thanks. If, you, if you're apprehensive or don't know what you want, then I'm just going to move on to someone new. But I still feel this person's going to come and reach out. They know what they need to do. They need to express themselves emotionally. They need to put all those cups on the table. And two people putting their cups on the table, talking. See, it's communication, the magician. Yeah, this is definitely some kind of wish fulfillment here. But someone's a little cautious, playing it safe. I think the Empress is going to play it safe at this point, to be honest. Yeah, I, I do. And the reason is because of something's already happened with this person. There was a lack of uh, reciprocity, a lack of equal give and take here. Whether it's emotions, feelings. I actually feel both people need to put those emotions out there, to be honest. I, it looks that way to me, you know. But I, I feel this person's a little concerned. The Empress has multiple opportunities. So I feel it's somebody who kind of played it safe. They tossed a few breadcrumbs, hoping the other person would uh, reply, reach out, or, you know, come towards them. So they would have that clarity, you know, before they opened up emotionally. Someone played it safe and lost out here because of it. Yeah, so someone who doesn't, it's a, it looks like a bit of a fear of rejection. So there it is. The birth is something new. Uh, so there's something being exposed in all this. Uh, could be a reconciliation, like I say, coming in with a whole new energy, expressing themselves, starting something new. But I feel it's more like there's a fear of, of someone here who's released somebody and starting someone new. Yeah, uh, could be something to do with work here. But it's about somebody putting in the work, putting in the effort. The Empress has already put in enough work. Uh, I feel this Empress energy, this person, this could be, like I say, yourself. Focus on your money career. You want somebody who puts in the effort, okay? You're not going to be the one to do all the work. 
It's the person who wants the other person to indulge them, you know, give to me, indulge me, give me what I want. Well, they didn't get what they wanted because of it. So that's where I feel that tower is there too. It's right there in the beginning. This is all about that tower moment, uh, the realization. Yeah. So I feel someone's tempering their passions, emotions, or pulling back and seeing things differently. This is about seeing things different, trying something different. Some of you are just going off and trying a different kind of person. Others of you, this person's going to be the one to come in and try something different, to be more emotionally open. Okay, you see? High vibrational, positive, happy. There's a lot of happiness, you know, it's right here, but it has to do with this initial communication. Yeah, I feel like we got a couple people here who, uh, someone's pulling back, trying something different. It could be to build, to put in some effort, to build a foundation. So it looks like there was something that wasn't built on a very solid foundation. There was a, you know, a little breadcrumbing maybe back and forth, a lack of reciprocity, emotional connection, or time being spent between two people. Uh, we got a couple people definitely focused on money here. So uh, both people are, so there's definitely something there. But we have this King of Cups coming in to put in the effort, to put in some work to build something, to build a solid foundation. So it looks like a reconciliation of sorts for a lot of you. Uh, others of you, you're just going to try something different, okay? You're healing and releasing. You've become the Empress. You're now ready for a different kind of person. It's time to try something different. Now, this could be to do with work and career as well. Some of you are craving something, maybe coming up with something unique, really focused on work. You may actually not even see this coming because <laughs> there's a lot of focus on money and work, financial stability, very grounded. I, I like that, you know, the Queen of Pentacles is very grounded. Someone who looks at a situation before they rush into it, you see. Yeah, it's all, the Queen of Pentacles likes to have a comfortable home, likes to be prepared for the future. So someone who likes to get comfortable with someone doesn't really like to rush into a situation. So there's definitely an energy of someone needing to try something different, maybe being more patient. This person may be needing to be a little more patient to put in more effort if they want to build a solid foundation. So definitely reconciliation for some. There's the Queen of Cups. Yeah, see, we have a couple people. It's about trying something different, being more emotionally connected, more available. You know, I feel like we have a couple people here who are just right for each other. Now, some of you, I can see you taking off in another direction. Definitely some of you. Uh, I do see you kind of looking at things with the temperance, pulling back and seeing there's somebody here that may, may you may have a realization yourself, this person's really not right for you. Okay, they may not be emotionally available enough or um, somebody who's emotional at all for that matter. So that's where some of you, I feel it changes, where uh, it's yourself um, recognizing that there's someone here that's not right for you and somebody who is having, you could be the one having the epiphany that this King of Cups, this person, this new person, there's definitely something new here and it's being exposed through uh, all this energy. So I see things speeding up and it delays. Yeah, it's a cycle ending, a whole new cycle. See, something new here. This is you're about to get something you want, okay? And I feel like this person's going to give you what you want. They're going to put in the effort. Uh, it's possible you're the one with the star realizing this person could have been, could be your hopes and dreams, but it could go vice versa. And it could be both people having that realization. You're about, you're everything that the other person, you, you both want here. It's just going to take a little bit of work, you know, a little bit of effort. It takes two. Uh, to build a solid foundation. So I feel some really positive energy here. So it's really just a matter of mastering it through communication, mastering the elements, looking at this situation about what's right for you, what makes you comfortable. You know, some of you, it's all one person though. And I feel they're having that moment most definitely. So it could be you though, like I say, either or, this is definitely one of those readings you can flip the energy. You know how you feel. Yeah, look at that. Two people building. It's an energy of two people building each other up, not tearing each other down or not rejecting, ignoring each other, uh, tossing breadcrumbs. It has to do with everything being out in the open. It has to do with this positive energy, high vibrational connection. See, it has to do with love. It takes two people to build. So there's definitely some kind of chemistry here between two people. 
if you have a couple people and multiple opportunities, Cancer, it's very possible, you know, you're just realize, realizing someone here is not right for you. You know, you may just realize that. I see some Sag energy, some Gemini, some Leo. You know, maybe you're just somebody who moves a little faster. You want somebody who's kind of on that same page, somebody who, you know, shares those same qualities. But there's love. There's definitely love, and it takes two people here. So some of you definitely a reconciliation. Others of you, you're healing. This is the Empress, that beautiful healing energy, loving yourself first, nurturing yourself, caring for yourself. Some of you have sacrificed. You've done a lot of caring, a lot of nurturing of other people, and it's now your turn to be indulged. Okay, that's what I feel is going to happen here. So take care. I wish you the best in this uh, energy. Just give it a little chance to play out. Don't try to assume right away everything that's going to happen, and it'll be a little different for each person. It all depends where you are. Uh, in this energy but there's love coming in uh, possibly something new but if not someone's about uh, two people are going to express themselves emotionally okay take care and we'll see you soon